top six best travel cameras of 2024. Hello guys, today in this video, we are going to help you to find out the best travel cameras in market. I made this list based on my personal opinion and I tried to list them based on their quality, durability, customer review, and more. If you wanna see their price and find out more information about them, you can check our links to the description below and like, comment, share this video, subscribe our channel. Thank you. Number six, OLM System OLM5. The OLM5 is only a relatively minor update of the Olympus OMD EEM5 Mark AU, but its combination of talents make it an ideal travel camera in our book. Particularly if you want the flexibility of interchangeable lenses, it shoehorns a lot of features into a compact, weatherproof body that's compatible with a wealth of equally small lenses. Most of its skills, including excellent in-body image stabilization and computational photography modes, are also designed with travelers and adventurers in mind. Our testing found that for its size, the L15 delivers excellent video and stills quality, which is bolstered by a stabilization system good for 6.5 stops of compensation that gives you a high hit rate of keepers. We also enjoyed the high quality feel of the camera's dials and those in-camera software tricks like live ND and in-camera focus stacking, which are ideal for macro shots or blurring skies, surf and water for an ethereal effect. Less good are the fairly average EVF resolution, 4K slash 30 limit for video and relative limitations of its smaller sensor, but these are all acceptable trade-offs considering this camera's size and price. The external controls are remarkably well laid out for a camera so small with a real quality feel to them. And as well as an EVF, you get a very angle screen. All of this system is pitching this as a go anywhere adventure camera, and it's certainly one of the best travel cameras you can buy thanks in part to some excellent, compact, and affordable lenses. Number five, Panasonic Lumix ZS200. With smartphones now raising the bar for point and shoot photography, compact cameras have to offer something special to justify their place in your travel bag. The ZS200 slash TZ200 does that with its large one inch sensor and versatile 15 X optical zoom. It might be towards the upper end of the budget compact camera market, but Panasonic's travel zoom continues to offer great value. Its large one in sensor produces better natural image quality than most smartphones, despite the latter's advances in multi-frame processing. Our tests found colors to be nice and punchy, with a dynamic range allowing you to recover lost shadow detail with post-processing if needed. Even at 24 millimeters, vignetting and distortion is nicely controlled. There's also a handy built-in electronic viewfinder, which makes it easier to compose images in bright light. It's still quite pricey, but this is still the best travel zoom compact camera available right now. One of the best cameras for beginners, this is a 1.0 inch sensor with a resolution of 20.1 MP. And that surface area is about four times the size of the sensors in most other travel zoom compacts. This means image quality is much better with much greater detail. It's not the first time we've seen a 1.0 inch sensor in a travel zoom compact. That accolade goes to the Lumix ZS100 slash TZ100 but whereas that camera sported a pretty modest, for a travel zoom camera, 10x zoom range, the Lumix ZS200 slash TZ200 sees Panasonic squeeze a 15x zoom into a similar size body. The 24 360 mm range makes the Lumix ZS200 slash TZ200 incredibly versatile, suited to capturing everything from sweeping vistas to tightly cropped details. Number 4. Nikon ZFP Travel photography is all about capturing memories and Nikon's Z Feet fully embraces the concept of nostalgia. It's a stunning homage to the 30-year-old Nikon FM2, complete with retro styling dimensions and dials. Despite the throwback design, it's a very modern camera inside, sharing many of its specs with the capable Nikon Z50. While some photographers might wish for a full-frame sensor, the Z Feet's APS-C number does a stellar job of capturing stills and 4K video, aided by reliable tracking autofocus. Our tests found that its 20.9 MP sensor had an excellent handle on noise, especially under ISO 800, while dynamic range was impressive. Its very angle touchscreen is also a brilliant addition, making it easy to frame travel selfies or folding away completely for a leatherback look that lets you pretend it's the 80s. The Nikon ZF isn't as sturdy as the camera that inspired it, there's no weatherproofing, for example, but it's still a beautifully unique camera for casual use. And with dedicated dials for ISO, shutter speed and exposure, plus a customizable lens ring, it's also an easy one to control on the go. The current Nikon Z lineup now consists of two APS-C cameras, two second generation full-frame models, the Nikon Z6U and Nikon Z7I. Number two, 
Olympus DG6. Olympus arguably started the rugged compact camera trend with its Tough series, and the TG6 doesn't break the mold. Innovation might have slowed, but the Tough TG6 is still one of the best travel cameras you can buy, and there's no questioning its freeze-proof, shot-proof, and waterproof credentials. Its industrial design felt reassuringly rugged in our tests, with slightly fiddly catch mechanisms that protect the ports. Large buttons make it convenient to operate beneath the waves, while the improved 3-inch LCD display also offers decent visibility in most conditions. We found image quality to be reasonable for a camera with a 1 half 3-inch sensor with nice, rich colors, although there was a tendency to overexpose and blow out highlights. An equivalent zoom range of 25-100 millimeters is fair, plus the inclusion of 4K video and raw shooting enhanced flexibility. It isn't a major upgrade from the TG5, but the Olympus TG6 is nevertheless a stellar option for all action travelers. These new changes sit on top of a capable core that sees a 12 MP sensor working with a lens equivalent to 25 100 mm with a maximum aperture of f/2 to 4.9. Raw shooting and 4K video are also on hand, while rugged credentials ensure the camera is waterproof to 15 meters, 50 feet, shockproof from 2.4 meters, 7 feet, crushproof to 100 kif, 220 off, and freezeproof to minus 10 c. The body comes in black and red finishes with an attractive industrial design and large buttons to make it convenient to operate under the waves and on land. The double catch mechanisms on the doors to the battery slash memory card compartment and ports protect the insides from any dust or water incursion, although they're a little small and fiddly. Number one, Fujifilm X100V, a premium compact camera with a fixed 23 mm of slash two lens and a design that's been inspired by 1950s analog cameras, Sounds like the very definition of niche. And yet, Fujifilm's X100V is one of the best travel cameras you can buy, as long as you're okay with that single focal length and no zoom. For a start, it takes the X100F small form factor and adds a supremely useful tilting touchscreen. The advantages are support for touchscreen gestures and easier shooting at low or high angles. Inside, a new 26.1 MP sensor and X processor 4 combine to produce improved autofocus image quality and high ISO performance. Our tests found that noise was well controlled up to ISO 6400, while photos had bags of detail with realistic colors. Add in the option to shoot 4K 30 footage on the fly, as well as a higher resolution hybrid EVF, and you've got a properly capable pocket performer. Provided you're happy to pay a premium, the series has long been considered camera royalty. Why? It comes down to a combination of four factors. This is the top six best travel cameras in 2024. Please make sure to subscribe our channel for these kind of information. Thanks for watching.